there are certain things that transgenders don't like to talk about. Am I correct, Laura Jane? Um, I mean, I, I think there's certain way to phrase questions, and there's certain <laughs> ways to to talk about things, you know. But sometimes people's approach oftentimes can be done the wrong way. All right, let me uh, put a personal <laughs> nature. I was never interested in the sexual angle and all that kind of thing. But, well, I was, but that's an important distinction because it's not a sex thing; it's a gender thing. And sexuality and gender are two totally different things. But I was always interested in what was it like when you uh, were the other sex to be in a, the body you didn't belong in. What was that like psychologically? Um, well, it's, it's kind of different than that, you know, because my body is my body. I've always had my body. I've never felt any different. I've just known that there's been a misalignment with the way people perceive me based on the way I perceive myself. And, and certain things may be hormonally that I would have liked to have corrected, you know? But as far as like, it doesn't mean you're like all of a sudden this different person when you say you're trans or well, you're transitioning. Did you feel, did you know? you feel awkward? Um, well, I felt like pressure oftentimes, which is where the dysphoria would come in, especially being in the roles where I was placed in, being in a, in a, in a band, being this male singer where you're supposed to fit this archetype of like fit this role, be, be, this, be this dude, and that wasn't me. So when you're forced to fit into a gender role, that creates extreme dysphoria and oftentimes is, leads to the breaking point. What's the wrong terminology? Is um, there wrong term? Well, I, you know, I think what you got to realize is that oftentimes it's it's more about you or the other person than it is the trans person because you're trying to give somebody a way for them to define you to understand you because when it comes down to it, me, I'm just a person. You're just a person. We're all just people, right. you know. So saying someone is trans, you just got to think, what's the best way to define them? What would I feel most comfortable saying in front of them? You know, you wouldn't feel comfortable calling me a tranny. You feel might be more comfortable calling me trans, right? And trans is just good like blanket terminology. I think that, you like trans. I think it sounds cool. So <laughs> that helps. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday through Thursday, on demand on Hulu and Aura.tv.